Homeward Bound on Newswatch 12 today is sponsored by Paws and Claws. featured pet is a one-year-old Bazenji mix named Oakley. Oh. Oakley was two days away from being euthanized for space at a very crowded overkill shelter when Catkins saved him from an ending he never deserved. Oakley is a super duper sweet guy. He looks larger in his photos than he is, weighing in at 34 pounds. Oakley loves people and other dogs, and he is a very happy, go-lucky guy with a wonderful medium size that would fit in well with most any family. Oakley has spent the last several months in a kennel at the other shelter, rarely having time out. That has all changed now as they are giving him plenty of one-on-one -on -one outings where they are showing him he is loved. He absolutely loves his walks and does very well on the leash. He really enjoys his playtime, especially squeaky plushies. His tail wags and wags when he greets another dog. And his favorite thing is getting love from humans, something he really missed out on for too long. We are so happy to help this guy find his forever loving home. Oakley is neutered, current on vaccinations, heartworm negative, and microchipped. He would love to meet you and your family. To meet him, you can submit an application found on Katkins' website, www.katkinsrescue.org. Look at him. He just looks like the cutest, apparently little, apparently he's not that big, little guy. Yeah, I, it's, you know, it'd be kind of fun to, 34 pounds, I don't know exactly if he's like a carry around in a purse sort of dog. Well, I don't think, I mean, that's more like kind of chihuahua sort of yeah. territory, but maybe, <laughs> maybe a lap dog that's just barely too big to be a lap dog, but can still fit if you need it. Hey, there's no such thing as too big to be a lap dog. <laughs> that is true. And I'm very happy to hear that Katkins was able to rescue him mm -hmm. from a not so great fate. So hopefully he finds his home. Seems like a very, very happy and very chipper dog. And of course, I mean, always help your sh animal shelters however you can. Oh, Donate, absolutely. volunteer. Um, there's, a, there's a lot of things that you, you can, can do. do for them. You know, I know they have a lot of fundraisers as well throughout the summer. And it's nice when people are coming up and visiting. Maybe they're at their lake home or summer home and they want to, you know, take the family out. Maybe they find their forever pet <laughs> while they're on vacation up here. Exactly. Especially, I mean, summertime is a great time to adopt an animal because oh. you can kind of spend quality time outside with it as well. True. I'm just curious to see... I think it'd be kind of fun to like put little floaties on them and kind of watch the dogs little splash around. That'd be kind of cute. <laughs> yes, absolutely adorable. <laughs> but for now, Devin, 